Welcome everyone to day 24 of the 28 day writing challenge. I am happy to report we have a book cover. So I want to show you what we had to choose from and the one that uh, we came up with. So I had my cover designer team come over. My cover designer team is myself, my wife, my oldest daughter, and two of her, our second oldest daughter, excuse me, and two of her teenage daughters, our granddaughters. And so we've come over and uh, they came over and we looked at our covers and uh, we were pretty well in agreement as to what we came up with. Let me show you the covers. All right, here we are. They're laid out on the ping pong table. So you'll notice that we have them uh, designated by A, B, there's cover B, C, D, E, F, and G. And uh, the way we narrowed this down is we compared every cover against every other cover. So we did A against B. We made our choice out of that. And then A against C, and then D, then E, then F, and G. Then we started with B. We didn't have to compare it with A because we'd already done that with A and B. So we did B with C, D, E, F, and G. And uh, likewise, then when we got to C, we had already compared against A and B, so we just compared it with D, E, F, and G, and so forth. And uh, we came up pretty well in agreement that with one of these covers in particular. But I will say this. We like to cover E, which is this one, valuing your spouse and uh, the silhouette there, and cover A, and cover B. Those three ended up being the top three of our choices. Now, some of our comments on them were, let me see if it looks better turned this way. I don't know if that's any better or not. I think it's just as good. Uh, on uh, A, we liked the fact that the title stood out to us, uh, that we could read the title easily. We liked the picture. It was a little washed out on the background, and so we had that. On B, uh, some of us really liked the wedding rings in there, and uh, the title was clear. Um, we weren't all enamored with the subtitle being put in the balloon to the side. And then over in E, uh, we like this one basically because the title pops out really well. Maybe getting the light a little better title pops out really well. Uh, subtitle is a little hard to read from the distance. In fact, if it was uh, down at Amazon uh, size, thumbnail size, you may not be able to read it, but that's really pretty common. And, uh, and we just like the picture on it. We also like the offset of the picture. Uh, we like the font for the title. I thought maybe I might come up with a different title, but uh, actually uh, the feedback that I got from my team was that they all liked the title. You remember this is the third book in a series of six books about the loving way to a successful marriage. Loving is an acrostic. The L stands for leaving. The O stands for overcoming. And the third one is V for valuing. 
And that's what this book is about, valuing your spouse. So we may just leave the working title as the regular title. I may get some feedback on the a survey that I do. But anyway, we have a title, so that's where we are today. I'm continuing to do rounds of editing on the chapters of the book. How about you? Have you written your book? <laughs> if you'd like to know more about how to write a book in 28 days or less, then go to Amazon.com and uh, just uh, look for how to write a book in 28 days. And it'll show up in the top results. If it doesn't, then add the uh, how to write a book in 28 days or less. Pretty sure it'll show up then. But if not, then add the full title, how to write a book in 28 days or less without stressing yourself to death. And you will be able to uh, get the book that shows the techniques the three methods used to be able to write a book in 28 days. And as I say, the rough draft is basically done, continuing to do the first round edit, and then we will go into launching the book. And that will take two or three weeks after we have the book written. So the book will soon be available. Maybe you would like to serve on my launch team I will talk to you more about that uh, next week. And uh, also I'm, I'm considering uh, running a sale on some of my books next week too. So stay tuned for that. Anyway, I'm happy to report that we have a cover and I appreciate our designer, uh, Katrina Richmond for presenting all of seven of these ideas to us. They were all good, and uh, we chose that uh, next to the last one. We really like that one, and so we're going to contact her. In fact, hi, Katrina, I see you're watching right now. <laughs> so we're going to ask you to go with that. I may ask you to tweak some of the things on it just a little bit. And uh, But anyway, thank you for your work. And the rest of you that are watching, if you're interested, I don't, I guess haven't found out uh, if Katrina is wanting to hire out very much on that. But if you would like to inquire of her, you could do that. Uh, you could email her at katrina at randysblogs.com. Or you can contact me and uh, I'll put you in touch. Anyway, I hope you have... A great day, and remember, you can write a book.